Welcome to Can Can Top Five. Today, animals that are total dicks. Number five, baboons. All right, now baboons are just like chimps. They're these little human-like creatures that freak me the fuck out. But after diligent research, I found even more reasons to hate them. Apparently, they're fucking dicks. When baboons feel threatened, they flash their teeth and eyelids like a bunch of fucking douchebags, and are known to group up and chase their enemies down in hordes. That's right, hordes, hordes of red-ass baboons stampeding towards you should you ever get on their bad side. And that's why they're number five. They're not complete dicks, but they're a bunch of chimpy cunts. Number four, saltwater crocodile. So if their face wasn't ugly enough, apparently so is their fucking attitude. These crocs have been known to attack boats without warning, and people just for getting too damn close to them. They're actually considered the number one animal to potentially eat a human. What the fuck, crocodiles? You have plenty of shit to eat that you don't need to be chewing on my fucking leg, or this guy's head, or that guy's arm. Fuck you, crocodiles. You're a bunch of dickheads. Just leave us humans alone. You've got plenty of fish to eat in the rivers. Number three, the female brown trout. So, being a male, I've got a real bone to pick with this one. While you may enjoy eating trout, you probably won't enjoy how big of a dick these guys are, or rather, how big of a dick these girls are. Female brown trout will actually fake orgasms to persuade their male counterparts to ejaculate ahead of time. Leaving the female's eggs unfertilized by his now useless sperm, which is floating in the river somewhere. Remember not to swallow the water next time you're swimming in a river. Come guzzling aside, what a bitch, right? Number two, common shrew. At first glance, this thing looks so adorable. I mean, look at that cute little tongue and nose. What's not cute? As these guys can actually inject venom into their prey from their bites, and are known to be very territorial, which is fucking horrifying, by the way. Want to know how they kill their prey? By crushing their damn skull. Now that's the most ruthless thing I've ever heard of. Thankfully for us anti-shrewites, these little cheeky bastards actually have a problem with being startled, to the point that, on occasion, the common shrew will be so stressed out it'll have a fucking heart attack. Ha! Fuck you, shrew. Fuck you. Number one, the bower bird. The bower bird has got to be the biggest downright asshole in the entire animal kingdom. So what's interesting is that they build these little house nest things for potential mates and to house their eggs. But they're jealous little assholes, and they'll actually go over to another bird's nest and fuck that shit up. What the fuck, bower bird? You're like that guy at the fast food drive-through who makes everyone wait because they forgot fucking onion on your burger. Just eat it without onion, you damn asshole. And same thing goes for you, bowerbird. Just stop fucking with other people's houses. And that's why the bowerbird is number one. He fucks up other people's houses. Thanks for watching Can Can Top Five. I hope you enjoyed your stay. If you'd like to see more videos, be sure to support us on Patreon and hit that subscribe button if you particularly enjoyed us. Cheers, mate. Can Can out.